intro here and in this video I want to show you a quick demo of Vitbox. So what is Vitbox? Vitbox is a player designed for marketers who live in 2019 and use the tools they have in their arsenal to make the most of their traffic. And why another player? We came with this player to help marketers solve a couple problems. Now, if you've been doing video marketing or using videos in your day-by-day -day marketing, I'm sure you've heard about the autoplay war that most browsers started a few months ago. Uh, that is probably the biggest hit since Google Penguin and it affected every marketer on an online business around the world. So we fixed this by autoplaying without sound, basically inviting your visitors to click on the video and start watching. And you can control this by uh, using this switch in here. So basically you have two options. You can either let it uh, play normally, uh, letting users users click on the play button or you can play it uh, muted and it looks more or less like a gif. Uh, now the second reason we've created this is the YouTube distractions. Don't get me wrong, uh, YouTube is a great platform and a great product overall but has a big issue for marketers. It's designed to, to keep users on their platform and not yours, not ours and to bring people there so they can sell more and more ads. So in the past few months, if you notice, they added more and more of those uh, ads related videos and now all the embedded vids uh, uh, from YouTube have lots of uh, buttons and links to click on all pointing to youtube.com. Of course, this affects us and drops our conversion rate, so we had to fix it. Basically, what we did is we added a thumbnail that displays uh, when people pause the video. So instead of seeing all the links and and buttons and related videos and whatnot from uh, from YouTube, you're going to see uh, this thumbnail. This is the default thumbnail, but you can uh, you can change it by dropping um, uh, a new one here. Any image will do just fine. Now, uh, apart from this, you have uh, all the normal things you, you'd have in a, a video player like video controls you can disable, enable them as you wish. You can allow people to pause, not allow them to pause the video and have them watch, watch the video continuously. Uh, you can have CTAs show up at your desired time so you can have CTA show when the video starts, when the video ends uh, or at a custom time or have it, um, have it display for the entire length of the video. Uh, you can have captions, the difference between captions and the CTA is the CTA is an image and the caption you can change text for it. And uh, the caption and the CTA and all the other controls have this start and end time you can use to to basically tell the, the player when to show them and when to hide them. Uh, the CTA and the caption both have a link you can use to, to send people to and you, you'll see the, how you how we make use of the caption in our own uh, in our own video and uh, the social buttons uh, this is this is basically the, the third reason uh, we uh, we created this video player and it's, it's the lack of true mobile design on existing players you know how these days most of the traffic is uh, on mobile phones and we wanted to let people uh, email us, call us, messages uh, directly from within the player. So as an example, imagine if you were a brick and mortar business and wanted people to call you in your video and you tell them to call you and from the settings of the player, you, you tell the player when to, to show the call now button. This is super helpful and uh, I'll show you how it works. So in our example, we have the, the phone call and WhatsApp message bundled together and they will show after tw 23 seconds inside the video and hide five seconds later. Uh, with, the, with the social buttons, you can have people uh, go to your Facebook page, to your Instagram page, or even text you from uh, by using the, the Facebook Messenger. So basically if you have, uh, you, can, you can use your, um, your personal profile page or your business page and you can have people uh, message you directly from their phone while watching your video. This is super important and super helpful. Uh, now the four, fourth reason and maybe one of the most important is the lack of integration with Facebook. You know how Facebook lets you track all conversions on your site and send you more and more people that convert, right? 
So uh, imagine if you wanted people who watched uh, people similar to the ones who watched at least 30 seconds from your video or people similar to those who called you from their phone. Now you can do this with our Facebook Deep integration for which you can change the settings in here. So you see uh, you have a lot of events you can use. You can uh, you can use a given milestone, which is maybe some custom time, like thirty seconds uh, within the video. You can have uh, you can have Facebook send uh, people like those who watched the video entirely, so until the end of the video. Uh, you can send you can have people you can have sorry you can have Facebook send more people that click on the Instagram button, on the Messenger button, on the Call Now button. So if you are using a Facebook pixel on your website, Vidbox automatically reports whenever something happens inside of our video. Either when a milestone is hit, for example, like I said earlier, uh, when the user watched more than 30 seconds of your video, where or whenever a CTA or phone call button is clicked, and so on. And finally, since, uh, since we love performance marketing, high conversions, and we geek around tweaking and adjusting stuff. We added Vidbox the option to split test, um, and it's it's not the way you think. Vidbox is smarter than that. So, for example, if you have two videos you're testing, you can have Vidbox pick the one that performs better for your specific conversion. So it's not just the uh, the video that generated more sales, but you can have uh, Vidbox pick the winning video based on more um, more conversions like uh, CTA clicks, like clicks on the Instagram button, like milestones. For example, if you want to to show the the video that generated more engagement, that generated more watches to more than 30 seconds of the video. Now let me show you Vidbox in action. I'll use the video above and trigger some cool some cool action so you get the idea. So first I'll have the the CTA show and then I'll have the social buttons, then after that, uh, after 16 seconds, I'll have the captions show for a couple of seconds. And lastly, I'll have the phone call and WhatsApp buttons. So uh, let me go here and refresh the page. This is the test page. And as you can see, the video starts, but without sound. So the users will be invited to click on the unmute video button and hey JV, it's click, click here starts. and I want to welcome you to the Vidbox JV page. First off, I want to thank you for considering joining this launch. That's going to be great. It has $8,000 in prizes, over $100 per lead and recurring built-in. You can see uh, if I pause the video, you don't see any related videos. This video is hosted, as you can see, it's hosted on YouTube. And if I pause it, you don't see any of that YouTube uh, links related videos whatever and, and the funnel review oh, access is ready sure. all you have to do is click here and request your affiliate link and we'll make sure you have everything ready to make this one of the best and these two are the your the phone call button and the messenger Not the whatsapp messenger button free again by removing its branding and the annoying recommended videos Okay, so this is uh, basically what uh, Vidbox can do for you and how it can help you. And let me know if you have any questions and hope to have you on board as an affiliate. Thank you.